Welcome to Daily Warfare Prayers. I invite you to pray and worship the Lord in the beauty of holiness. The Lord is my light and my salvation. Whom shall I fear? The Lord is the strength of my life. Whom shall I be afraid? The God of glory goes before me. His love surrounds me. His peace anchors me. And his power emboldens me. The Lord is my rock and my salvation. For my hope is in him. When evil surrounded me and darkness was suffocating my sight. When my enemies had me where they wanted me. It was the Lord who came down from his throne to see about me. The Lord defended me when I cried out from his temple for help. The Lord saved and redeemed me. He created in me a new heart and transformed my life. I was once full of sin, but I was washed by the blood of the Lamb. I was once confused and lost, but the Lord's light led me to life. I was once hopeless, and I found my future in Him. I found my purpose. I found fulfillment. I found joy. I found myself. For the Lord is a strong tower, The righteous run to him and are safe. The Lord is a shield for all of those who look to him for protection. Blessed be my rock. For I move, live, and have my being because of the God of Abraham, Isaac, and Jacob. I thank you today, Father, for moving mountains in my life. For your faithfulness in the valleys and your provisions of abundance, I thank you and bless your wonderful name. Oh, what a wonderful name it is. What a powerful name it is. The name of Jesus Christ, our King. It's in your wonderful name that I declare the victory in my life and forevermore. Amen. Philippians 2, 5 through 11. Let this mind be in you, which was also in Christ Jesus, who, being in the form of God, did not consider it robbery to be equal with God, but made himself of no reputation, taking the form of a bondservant and coming in the likeness of men and being found in appearance as a man. He humbled himself and became obedient to the point of death, even the death of the cross. Therefore, God also has highly exalted him and given him the name, which is above every name, that at the name of Jesus, every knee should bow, of those in heaven and of those on earth and of those under the earth, and that every tongue should confess that Jesus Christ is Lord, to the glory of God the Father. 